again, it's uh, knowing, being aware of everything around, um, knowing where your swords are, the angle of your swords, um, the, the grip, uh, all the things that are the same when you're cutting with one sword, uh, it's twice that when you cut with two, twice as difficult at least. Okay, I'll be using the short sword here, and this technique is uh, for wakizashi. And the wakizashi is only used in a very, uh, very tight, uh, tightly confined area. Um, this so uh, kata, called kodachi, for short sword, kodachi kata, um, was designed for uh, basically seven attackers. Uh, well, six attackers. Um, you don't use the long sword because you're in a very tight area. You're being pressed, very hard pressed for room and space. So you draw your sword, short sword, very quick, um, quick slicing cuts. Uh, these will all be side cuts, and it's primarily um, to achieve distance and get space to move. So the long sword can be used. Uh, this is the only time a short sword would be used, um, is if you are very pressed for space unless you were attacked by many people, and then you would want to utilize all your weapons, drawing both swords. Wilson, Ken Hackathorn, and Lenny McGill Productions have teamed together to produce the most informative, technically correct approach to modern defensive pistol tactics and shooting techniques ever released on videotape. Twelve titles in all, packed with the latest on skills, drills, equipment, mindset, tactics, and shooting techniques, plus a whole lot more. Wilson and Hackathorn are both experts in their fields, and Lenny McGill Productions is known worldwide for its high-quality firearms-related video productions. 
Together, they have created a series of programs that will entertain, amaze, inform, and make you aware of the tactics you need to survive a real gunfight. Basic Self-Defense Handgun Use and Safety is a two-part set covering the basic fundamentals of shooting, grip, stance, sight picture, sight alignment, and trigger pull, plus informative segments on self-defense pistols and ammunition, what happens in a real gunfight, what gun is best for you, 9mm versus 45, and lots more. Start to think about how, how can I practice and train that's going to increase my chance of survival. Advanced Self-Defense Shooting Tactics and Techniques is a five-part series that takes the viewer to a new level in both shooting skills and tactical knowledge. Extensive discussions and demonstrations on the use of cover, shooting while moving, both towards and away from your target. You'll learn the advantages of a speed reload versus a tactical reload, aimed fire versus flash sight picture versus point shooting, using your vehicle for cover, shooting from a vehicle, two shots versus one shot. Over five hours in all of the finest pistol instruction techniques in the world. One of the best lines I've, I've heard, and it's a great one, is people saying, what's the best weapon you can have? It's your mind. Combat Ready Self-Defense Shooting Practice Drills is the first program ever that takes you into the practice routines of two of the finest pistol shooters in the world. Bill Wilson and Ken Hackathorn share 20 years of experience as they show you how to practice like a pro and increase your skill level faster and easier. You see in both the front posts. Oh yeah, on that kind of a shot, I'm getting a true sight picture. And you seeing the both front and rear sight? Oh yeah, front and rear sight, good alignment, you know, really paying attention to the front sight. Actually, just like I would be taking a 25 yard precision shot. Nightmaster. Low light shooting and flashlight techniques is an up-to-date look at the equipment and tactics needed to successfully utilize a handheld light source in an armed encounter. Wilson and Hackathorn demonstrate the latest flashlights, their advantages and disadvantages, and how to use them for your tactical advantage. Sometimes you can't move a big distance, but if you're here and you're illuminated and all of a sudden you see a threat, one step to the right, one step to the left, either way to get out of that zone where the incoming fire may be returned to. House Clearing and Cornering Tactics and Techniques is a 75-minute program that shows you how to enter a house or room and increase your chance for survival. Plus, you'll learn how to maintain cover, why to stay out of the fatal funnel, how to look for and avoid telegraphing target indicators, and the importance of maintaining distance from walls and cover. Plus, a very graphic demonstration of cover versus concealment as Wilson and Hackathorn shoot through ordinary walls and cinder blocks. So unlike the normal uh, indoor walls, sheetrock walls, which in reality are just concealment, concrete blocks, in fact, provide very good cover. Practical Concealed Carry is a 90-minute program that shows the basics of concealed carry, how to fit a holster to your body, over six different methods of carry, high fire drills, pocket holsters, safety, and lots, lots more. The virtue of the fanny pack is that if you're in that proverbial summer evening going out for dinner and you're just wearing a pair of shorts and a polo short or a t-shirt, the fanny pack gives you a means of carrying a little bit more substantial firearm and uh, having it readily available. Building the ultimate 1911 self-defense handgun is designed to save you time and money. The master gunsmiths of Wilson's Combat demonstrate advanced gunsmithing techniques as Bill Wilson and Ken Hackathorn discuss what are the most practical and necessary custom procedures for your 1911 handgun. Overall, this new series of 12 professionally produced videos is one of the finest resources of self-defense handgun shooting tactics and techniques in the world. Brought to you by Wilson Combat.